Hey all here, OS Reviews. Today we are doing a hands-on review of Moft. This is a laptop stand that can prop up the computer at two angles, 25 degrees or 15 degrees for better ergonomics when you're viewing back content. So it lifts the screen upwards and also makes it a bit easier to type on, better for your fingers and wrists. Now it sells for $19 and it claims to be the thinnest and most invisible laptop stand on the market. You can find it on Kickstarter right now. So it's currently a campaign project, but they They've already exceeded their goal and there's still a month left so it seems to be quite successful. So here's a quick kind of short video showing how it works in action. It works with any computer up to 15.6 inches and uses magnets to uh, pop up at various angles. Um, it's extremely slim and comes in a multitude of different colors as well. Now it can also hold up to 18 pounds which is really impressive considering it's made out of what looks like a fabric material but it's actually a kind of carbon glass and the adhesive can be removed from a laptop and put back on over 400 times. So here's the packaging. It's very simple and we have the dark gray color, almost like a manila envelope. On the back we have some additional information about the height, the fact that it is scratch proof, and the material here is using fiberglass which makes it spill and heat protective. And that's it. There are no additional instructions because it's basically just peel it on and you're ready to go. It should be much simpler to apply than even a real screen protector because there's no air bubbles to worry about. On the front here we just have the moth logo. It does really feel like a fabric material, uh, almost like a felt, very similar to something like a Google Home Mini smart speakers texture. And then on the back is where we have just the adhesive with a protective film that we can peel off to reveal the sticky side. And then down here we have a soft touch kind of rubber material. It's extremely grippy in texture to prevent it from sliding around since the bottom here will be touching the table. So it kind of acts as a rubber feet of sorts. We can see on this machine the positioning fits perfectly between the rubber feet and we also don't have any ventilation grills that we're covering up. So on something like this, it works great. This is a jumper easy book, also a very similar to a MacBook's design. And then just press down with a bit of force evenly on all the corners when we are satisfied and we are pretty much done. So it's interesting because the adhesive is mostly on the top half. Uh, the bottom half here can still kind of lift upwards as you can see, but for the most part it stays down pretty well because of magnets and so it doesn't become obtrusive if you're sliding it into a laptop sleeve or into a backpack for instance. So using the stand is actually really simple. Just lift it up a little bit and afterwards it kind of just naturally falls over and reclines into this natural position. It says moft on here so it's a little bit of clever advertising and again the bottom here is a soft touch rubber pad so it provides resistance and prevents the laptop from sliding around on a flat surface, which is great. Now, if you want to use this on your lap, it's a bit less stable. Something that's comparable to a surfaces design where the kickstand is best optimized if you have it on a flat desk. Now, if I want to recline it to the 15 degree angle, so going even further back, I can just lift this, this flap over and then push it down. And now you can see the angle has been also shoved down a bit more, but we can still see the company's logo on the bottom here. If I want to just lift it up a little bit, that will naturally put it back to the 25 degree angle. And here's just a closer look from the side of the 15 degree angle. Here's the 25 degree angle. You can see it definitely elevates it a bit more but provides the same structural integrity. It actually has even less flexing if I'm pressing down here in this particular angle. And with the laptop open up we have the full ergonomic experience with the keys which are now much more elevated for easy typing. Pushing down there's really no shifting or movement at all so it's incredibly stable. Uh, so it feels as stable as a metal stand. And same thing goes with the 15 degree angle. It's also very stable, but there's slightly more flexing and movement in the 25 degree. So shifting the moft closer to the bottom here would actually provide more stability if you are using it in this 15 degree mode. All right, so it obviously works well with an Ultrabook or an Ultra Portable that has a more premium aluminum construction, but what about some other devices? I'm gonna now try it with a Chromebook, and this is a 11.6 inch device. It's also fanless, which I think is going to be the best use case for these because it doesn't cover up any ports or fans, which uh, many computers may place on the back. And indeed, at the 25 degree angle, it's just very firm and stable. If we push it over to the 15 degree angle, however, now if you try and tilt the monitor all the way back and start to kind of pressing on the top row of the keyboard, it can still occasionally flip over. Still, the 25 degree angle, as you can see here, is just very stable and firm and comfortable to use. 
and we've removed it without leaving any residue or sticky marks at all. So it's very easy to apply and remove. And now for the third experiment, I'm gonna try a tablet. Now it's not something they're advertised to support, but I'm curious because if you have a larger tablet maybe running on Windows, um, it may be interesting to use it as kind of a kickstand. First thing to note is that this particular tablet is not fanless. So like a lot of other Windows computers, you'll see a lot of ventilation grills, which you should hopefully avoid to prevent overheating. So we're gonna try and shift this down a little bit and uh, then kind of press down with the sticky pad it won't be quite as seamless anymore so it really is i think designed for i would say 12 13 inches and upwards but otherwise yes it actually does work you can see that we are now shifting it downwards and could still be very good if you're using the tablet as a text entry tool so as a typing stand for a tablet it certainly is another use case so that's more or less it for our hands-on review of moft the smallest, most invisible laptop stand, and it actually works a lot better than expected. It's a very cool concept made out of fiberglass. It's surprisingly sturdy for something so slim and lightweight. For $19, it could be a very useful accessory to have to improve the ergonomics, the viewing experience, the typing experience, better for your hands in the long run, transforming your laptop into kind of a desktop replacement. So I'll end this video by saying Moff did also give us a few of these to give away, so if you are interested, be sure to stay tuned but for now that's been our video and if you're interested in picking one up you can check them out on kickstarter thanks for watching here at os reviews that's been moffed the quote-unquote invisible laptop stand